Hello. In this video, we're going to convert most given to us of an element, convert that to mass of an element. And this could have many variations. And for convert this, we need to go back to our old, remember the chart we had we did last time of different atoms. And we had, in this case, let's do sodium. And sodium has a mass of 22.99, which is what's important to us, and uh, 11 protons. But what's important to us right now is the mass of sodium, this over here. And the question says, convert 2.50 moles of sodium into grams or mass. And the setup to do this type of work will never change. And if it does, it changes just according to the question. And what I want you to think of is that what's given to me is this, 2.5 moles of a certain element. Let's set it up. So we will do given to me 2.5, 0 moles of sodium because that's the element I'm dealing with that I just told you about. So let's add sodium to this, moles of sodium, 2 grams. Do a little T. At the bottom, if I have moles on top, at the bottom, I'm going to have moles at the bottom. And the standard is one mole. And then on top, what I will have here is the mass of the element. In this case, it's 22.99. And that will be grams of the element. Therefore, when I, come, when I multiply 2.50, 2.50, times 22.99 divided by 1, which it should make no difference at this point. The answer I get is 57.48. That will be grams of sodium. I want you to notice something. I want you to notice, very important, notice the setup. What I did over here, I first had made a T. What I had on top was information given. Information given. On top, right next to it, I had info to go to. In this case, I was going into mass. And at the bottom, I had the same type of unit. In this case, I had one mole. Why one mole? Because if I make a T again, I was given moles. I cancel with one mole. And on top, I am going to, in this case, mass, which is what the question is asking me to do. This is the setup that you should have for this type of questions always in order to be consistent and in order to be accurate. I hope this helps you out.